Bonjour and welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing an unboxing. I bought a new machine and this machine is a laser engraver. So the goal today is to set up the machine and do a first test. So let's dive in. <music> Let's start with an opening. Oh. Oh, my glasses. Okay. I wonder. Okay. Okay. I said that it was an unboxing video, but in reality, I want to do three things today. First, I want to unbox it, obviously, not only to test the machine, but I want to discover it. Uh, second, I want to create some kind of an enclosure that allows me to hide the laser inside of a box to hide the laser from my eyes, but also to use a fan to push all the smoke outside of my garage. And third, I want to do a real first project. So this is the goal of this small video today. So stay with me until the end and you're going to discover what I made. Okay, now that the laser is all built, let's create the enclosure. To see inside the enclosure, I decided to recycle an old FPV camera from one of my big drones and a small screen that I'm gonna glue on the surface of the enclosure with hot glue. And this is it, the screen that I will glue on the box with the FPV camera just under it. And this is it, the partial setup, almost complete. I did a couple of tests here. I have a test on plywood and I noticed that the, there is a difference depending on the wood. I did another test on cardboard and I'm actually printing another image and I can see through the screen very clearly and I'm absolutely satisfied. The only thing that is left is evacuate the smoke. And to do that, I'm gonna cut a hole, install a tube and push the smoke through this other fan that is on the door. When looking at this image, which is very precise, I notice some small errors. And this is because of the, the weight of the laser. As you can see here, it's pretty unstable. So to resolve this problem, I decided to screw it on the table with this rod. The second problem is the wiggling in the head. Unfortunately, this limits the speed uh, that I can print. And the third one is the height. It depends, depending on the material, like the laser focus may vary. So I decided to uh, use a small plywood so I can adjust the laser to a fixed height and screwing everything in place. And I hope this will resolve these small issues. So now it's time to start my small project. Let's do it. So as a first quick project, I've been asked to create a beer opener and this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut it with my CNC and engrave an image. I don't know what image will be engraved so far, I have a couple of ideas, but I'm, I'm gonna try to engrave the image on the surface of the wood. So let's try it. And here we have it, a beer opener, homemade, with an engraved image. I'm so satisfied. And this is the final setup. I installed a fan to evacuate the smoke that the laser produces. I have the image coming from the FPV camera and I installed a tube to evacuate all the smoke to the other fan that is on the door. 
And this concludes the preparation for my latest machine. I am ready to create new kinds of project. I'm so happy and excited. So this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe and share. See you next time. Bye.